we wish you all the best in your country. We congratulate you on uh, the uh, incredible progress you have already made and the progress that I am sure you will continue to make as, uh, as you continue to serve as president. Uh, I wish we'd known it was your birthday. We would have gotten a, a, a cake. Uh, um, but with, uh, with that, at least we can uh, applaud you and, and thank you for coming thank with you us here today. Thank, thank you. you. foster our development, we will look west, east, north, and south with our prejudice. But there should be no surprise if we are more welcoming to those who are prepared to invest in our priority areas. There are increasingly loud anxieties being expressed about the close relations developing between China and Africa, including our own country of Ghana, and some have allegedly seen in it a real danger of a new colonization of the African continent, this time by China. It is fair to say that we are all much wiser about these things, and we're going to go into these new relations with our eyes wide open. Nobody is coming, pretending to, bring in, to be bringing God's word in one hand and taking our lands and resources with the other. This time around, we will look after our interests in much the same way as we know all other nations that we deal with look after their own interests. Thank you very much, Mr. President. And uh, my name is Colin Stadzi. I come from Ghana and a graduate student at the Harris School of Public Policy. It's very exciting to have you here. Um, thank you for walking us through those great initiatives being um, led by your administration. I want to find out to what extent will these initiatives be implemented or stopped if your party does not win election in the next elections? We don't want to contemplate that. <laughs> <laughs> but in any event, in any event, really, if these are ongoing activities, we're starting, in, we're starting now, effectively. We spent the last 18 months negotiating the commas and the dots and crossing the T's and uh, dotting the I's of the agreement. And now we're ready to start. Uh, there's another at least 18 months before we have to go to the polls and, 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 and uh, account for our activities. I'm assuming that by that time, this whole program will be very, very, very much uh, launched on its way. And I'd be surprised if uh, a successor government was to come and say that uh, th this is something that uh, th they don't want for our people because I think it's so essential. But in any event, as I said, uh, the, the, the possibilities of our losing 2020 are relatively remote as things stand now.